do you think that there are foods that generally pretty much everybody should avoid and maybe some that you think that maybe are pretty beneficial for everyone? Oh well, yeah. Well, there's nothing is nothing is for everyone. Everything is never for everybody. Uh, when it comes to food, now we can look at the at the non-organic food which has the glyphosate which unfortunately is in everything today we even breathe it but at least to eat uh, organic food we avoid the you know the heavy spraying of, of food because the glyphosate they say it's not harmful for people but what it does there is a pathway called the shikamet pathway where enzymes and bacteria have to travel into the digestive system to produce and create the right um, uh, milieu for digestion. So this doesn't happen. So that's another thing why people get gut problems. And when they get gut problems, they get brain problems. And the other way around too, people who get, uh, and I don't know how well known that is, Everybody who has a concussion or a heart, a head injury, you can take football players and <laughs> all kinds of people like that. They all, their digestive system gets affected because it's a direct, direct correlation between the, with the vagus nerve, between the nerve, uh, the brain and the digestive system. 